I was a satellite communications engineer. I was helping to develop, test, and launch the world's most advanced communication satellites. I was a junior high and high school math teacher. I was a software developer building and designing software systems for companies in Chicago. I asked that question, is there more that I can be doing with the technical abilities God's given me than just um, serving in, at a company? Can God use these skills for the kingdom? Our pastor at church did a series in which he challenged people to consider what might you do differently for the cause of introducing more people to the Lord Jesus. The Lord initially called me into missions when I was in ninth grade and there was nothing specific, so it wasn't until I was on my first date with my husband, I was in denial that we were even on a date, and he looks across the table at me and says, I don't know if you know this or not, but I'm raising support to go into full-time mission work, and if you don't see missions in your future, then we just need to be friends. Well, the rest is history. <laughs> I was afraid that I was going to be relegated to using old technology, and yeah, the Lord had wonderful surprises for me. I've ended up using more technology in the satellite arena than I ever could have if I had remained in industry. I think the hardest thing was moving from a mindset of always giving to missions to one where we needed to receive. I was quite concerned that there wouldn't really be a good place for me since I'm not an engineer but God really surprised me and he has given me several areas where I can use my skills and now he's even given me a place where I'm learning a new skill and I'm really loving it. I'm John Anderson. I'm a software developer and chaplain at Sunset Solutions. I'm Jackie Benedict. I work in media production here at Sunset Solutions. I'm David Russell, a registered professional engineer as well as President and CEO of Sunset Solutions. I would say first recognize that the Lord drives the process ultimately, but you need to be active as well. Ask that, those questions, can you be doing more? And then knock on some doors and get some affirmation from some trusted people in your life, perhaps your pastor, and then see where the Lord takes it. Our God is a big, big God with a big, big plan, and He can use absolutely anyone. And I believe that He has equipped each one of us uniquely with talents, with interests, with experiences that can be applied to fulfilling His purposes in this world. I think that God can really surprise you with the different skills that are necessary in all types of ministry. And so if God is tugging on your heart, I would say pursue that. Find out where would be a good fit for you and run toward it.